This era elevated the role of doctors to trust professionals with powerful tools. A powerful example in biotechnology is in silico medicine in AI platform, which discovered a potential treatment for fibrosis under a month. A myth that captures the spirit of this new era of medicine is the story of Asclepius, the Greek god of healing. Asclepius was said to have learned the secrets of life and death from observing a snake. Proteins that misfold can cause brain disorders like Alzheimer's disease and Parkinson's disease. With AlphaFold's advanced AI predictions, researchers can better understand these diseases at a molecular level. AI is also advancing in neuroscience by enhancing brain-computer interferences BCIs for paralyzed individuals. Welcome to Skolico. Today we'll see how AI serves as a healer in medicine and biotechnology. Medicine has evolved in remarkable ways and today it's transforming once again. In its earliest form, medicine was based on the intuition and trial and error. Healers would spend years testing plants and herbs, hoping to find cures. For every plant that worked, thousands didn't and some even harmed patients. In fact, a doctor who helped found the Mayo Clinic once admitted that most of his treatments were ineffective. And in his bag, only two tools worked, reliably morphine to ease his pain and a saw for amputations. The second era of medicine began after World War II with the mass availability of vaccines and antibiotics, which doctors could cure rather than just treat symptoms. As researchers, Abigail Salyer and Dixie Witt observed, antibiotics transformed medicine, allowing doctors to tackle diseases that previously could not be cured. This era elevated the role of doctors to trust professionals with powerful tools. Today, we are entering a third stage called molecular medicine, where scientists can study and treat at the genetic and molecular levels. This allows us to fight illness by targeting them at the root cause, protein by protein, molecule by molecule, using detailed genetic maps. Scientists now identify the weak spots in germs and pathogens giving rise to what some call the theoretical medicine. Thanks to advancements like we can analyze disease down to tiny genetical errors. For instance, Huntington's disease found on chromosome 4 involves a genetic sequence that repeats more than usual resulting in reduced brain chemicals and severe symptoms. Cystic fibrosis, discovered in 1989, can be caused by just a three-pair base deletion in gene on chromosome 7, a tiny error with serious consequences. Other conditions like Lesch-Nyon syndrome and Duchenne's muscular dystrophy involve similar genetic mutations. And then there are polygenetic diseases. Conditions influenced by multiple genes and environmental factors. These diseases are hard to pinpoint and treat because they involve many unknown interactions which remain a challenge even in today's advanced medical field. This new age of medicine is closely tied to AI, which accelerates the process of analyzing complex genetic data and developing new treatments. A powerful example in biotechnology is in silico medicine in AI platform which discovered a potential treatment for fibrosis under a month. A process that would normally take years, by analyzing biological data, AI identified the molecular structures that could slow down the disease, saving years of research and testing time. Another promising AI application in biotech is IBM's Watson, used to speed up cancer research. By examining massive volumes of research papers, Watson identified the key genetic associated with cancer and suggested the potential drugs that could target these genes. This AI-driven approach has become uh, instrumental in personalizing cancer treatments, offering a tailored drug that addresses specific genetic variations in patients' cancer cells, helping doctors make targeted and more effective treatment decisions. AI is also advancing in neuroscience by enhancing brain-computer interferences BCIs for paralyzed individuals. Neuralink, for instance, is used as AI to decode the brain's signals and translate them into actions, allowing people to control devices and communicate by simple thinking. This technology has given people back a sense of independence and is rephrasing the connection between mind and body. 
Additionally, the Connectome project is using AI to map the human brain's intricate neural networks. This ambitious project aims to uncover how neurons connect and interface to create memories, thoughts and emotions. Understanding these pathways could lead to a groundbreaking treatment for mental health disorders and cognitive diseases, giving us a new insight into a brain's networking. Another exciting example of AI in neuroscience is DeepMind's AlphaFold project, which revolutionized our understanding of protein folding, a critical process in brain function and diseases. Proteins that misfold can cause brain disorders like Alzheimer's disease and Parkinson's disease. With AlphaFold's advanced AI predictions, researchers can better understand these diseases at a molecular level, leading to a new approach of early detection and treatments. Demis Hassabis and John M. Jumper have successfully utilized artificial intelligence to predict the structure of almost all known proteins, earning them the Nobel Prize in Chemistry 2024. The proteins that actually do the Yemen's work of making the body function. If you compare a body to a construction site, the DNA contains the blueprints. But the proteins do the heavy lifting of the foreman and construction workers. A blueprint is useless without an army of workers to carry it out. This tears the Nobel Lieutenant David Baker developed a computer software that could predict the protein structures, a software called Rosetta which would allow them to create an entirely new proteins. Designing a brand new protein from scratch is called a de novo design. Proteins are a workhouse of biology. Not only do they make up the muscles that energize our body, they also digest our food, attack germs and regulate our bodily functions. A myth that captures the spirit of this new era of medicine is the story of Asclepius, the Greek god of healing. Asclepius was said to have learned the secrets of life and death from observing a snake, which provided another snake with the healing herb. Snakes, symbols of wisdom and renewal, became associated with medicine. Just as Asclepius learned the sacred knowledge, AI now gives scientists the tools to understand and treat illness that were once untouchable. Today, AI stands as the modern Asclepius uncovering the secrets of life's deepest processes to heal, understand, e and even regenerate. In blending ancient wisdom with modern science, AI-driven medicine is transforming biotechnology and neuroscience, opening new paths in healing that brings us closer to and answering humanity's oldest questions about life, death and the mind. Thank you.